Hey, what's up guys? Um, it's Junior from Pillings Guitar. Today we'll be checking out how to play Jared by Whiskey. Um, so this song, as you can see, I was playing it in the original key. Uh, but don't worry, I'm going to show you an easier way to play it so you don't have to um, struggle through the bar chord. But if you also know how to play bar chord, I will encourage you to play it. Um, okay, don't run away from it. So before we start guys, please don't forget to hit the subscribe button and um, don't forget to also leave a notification button on so you can get notification anytime I upload any um, new videos. And also don't forget to like and share it and um, let's go straight to the song. So I'm just going to take you straight on. So the number system we're using for the song is the 4321. Very simple. Okay, so if you're in the key of C, easy to follow. So I'll show you what was playing the original key and then I'll move on to the key of C. C. Okay. So in the original key we have the B major 7. Okay, so right here I'm battling with my first finger on the, on the second fret from the A string down. And then I have my um, second finger on the G, okay, right there. And then I have my pinky on the D, uh, fourth fret, sorry, my ring finger on the uh, D, fourth fret, and then my pinky is going to be on the B, fourth fret. And you just pick, so I'm picking from the, sorry there, so I'm picking from the um, A, it's a simple, arpe simple arpeggio. And then the next chord will be the um, A sharp minor 7. Okay, you can just do one finger one here. If you're strumming, you can pull your, your ring finger right here. So I'm right here on the 6th fret. Okay, with my first finger. If you're strumming, take your ring finger and place it on the 8th fret of the A string. Or if you're picking. Next chord is going to be your G sharp minor 7, exactly what you're playing here, just slide back twice. And then your last chord is going to be your F sharp major 7. Okay, F sharp major 7, so right here I'm forming like an A minor chord. So if you come here and do your A minor here, with your first finger on the, um, second finger actually, on the um, on the B string first fret, your... Um, ring finger will be on the D on the second fret and your pinky will be on the um, G second fret just slide down once and now you can take your first finger just place it on the root note here which will be the F sharp okay and you pick so I'm picking the E note the D note the G and then the B one more time B major 7, A sharp minor 7, G sharp minor 7, and F sharp major 7. And I have this um, passing sort of chord here. So I'll go back to the G um, sharp minor 7. Okay, so now let me move, um, shift my attention to the key of C. So remember again, the number system is it's a four, three, two, one. So you're basically just going backward. So again, if you take that F, um, F sharp major seven, now this becomes the one. Just slide it down. So you're right now on the um, on the four chord in the key of C. Okay, and then the um, the three three would be the E minor. So E minor right here, I'm just using my last two fingers on the A string and then on the um, D string. And then we have the um, next chord, which would be the two, will be on the, um, it's, a, it's a minor seven again. So you can play your D minor seven. Okay, so D minor seven right here, I'm barring this first two. Uh, string so the B the E and the B with my first finger on the first fret and then my next finger which would be my second finger will be right there on the D on the G sorry and then you pick from the um, from the D all right and then last would be your C major 7 C major 7 is very simple here okay just using just two fingers it's like your C just take off your first finger. So right here on the, um, with my ring finger 
on the A string of the third fret and then with my um, middle finger on the um, D string second fret and you pick from the A and so if you've mastered that, that chord progression um, what you need to do now if you want to be in the right key you take your capo using the key of um, key of C so you have C um, C sharp D D sharp E F F sharp okay so the song is the key of F sharp so you bar it here on the sixth fret and you play exactly the same chord um, shape that I showed you in the key of C so you know if you play along with the original song you can you will realize it sound exactly the same okay okay you realize it's exactly the same so Really and truly, in terms of the picking um, for the song, I'm just using some si simple arpeggio. So, um, you know, you just have just a very, very simple, like, subtle, you know, sort of filter. So you have... Dun, 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 dun. So for this, for this um, first chord, you have thumb on the bass note. You pick the your index finger on the D. Then you have the G with your middle finger. And then you have your... Um, ring finger with for the B okay you can do your um, mute in here then E minor exactly the same thing okay and then for the for the um, D minor 7 I've just moved my fingers down now so you can see my thumb is playing the D um, note here and I'm picking my G, B, E, okay, and then go to the C uh, major seven. So for the C major seven, I'm right here on the C note, okay, and then my rest rest of my fingers are on the G, um, the B, and the E. Sorry there. They put it to, put it together. Sorry there. Okay. So um that's how you play the song. So I really hope you guys have enjoyed this tutorial. Um, if you have, please don't forget to um, leave your comment below. And if you have any song requests, just drop them down. If you are stuck in any part of the song, please let me know in the comment section. And I will respond as soon as I can. So take care, guys. See you in the next video. Bye.